Hey guys, welcome back to the TSC Industries Yamaha R3 Superbike build. We have a very exciting episode for you today. Our triple clamp is back from the machine shop. It is ready to go. This is a beta version. We'll have to test this on the bike. So in this episode, we'll show you the installation of this part on our R3. So in this episode, we will only be concerning ourselves with the installation of this beta unit on our race bike. Back in episode three of the series, we gave you guys the rundown of the engineering and design aspects that went into producing these parts. Highly encourage that you watch episode three if you haven't seen it before, if you wanna know the background on these components. So for now, let's just strip the bike down, extract the OEM components, and then we'll halt at that point. We'll take them to the scale and we'll weigh them against this new setup to see just how much weight reduction we accomplished in this setup. So I'm gonna start, we're gonna shoot a time-lapse video for you guys' enjoyment, and I'll catch you in a few. All right, boys and girls, we've extracted the OEM parts. We're here in our warehouse where our most uh, precise scale is. We're gonna weigh these for you now and let you know how we did. OEM comes in at 5.9 pounds. And our new TST setup is 3.1 pounds. That's a difference of 2.8 pounds, it's almost three pounds almost half the mass of the OEM unit. Now, this is not 100% precise because we already cut off some bosses from here that used to house the ignition. That's probably worth a couple of ounces, but who's counting? We've achieved 47.5% mass reduction in these parts. I'm very proud of that. These also will perform a lot different in uh, regards to the suspension action. So let's now jump back to the bike, install them and see how they came out. All right guys, I had some fun here wrenching on this bike again. The installation was flawless. The design worked out really well. The execution of this part made it go in just like the OEM setup does. And uh, this is a beta version. It's really nice looking, but we don't know if it's gonna do exactly what we wanted it to. In theory, it works out, but now we have to put it through its paces and. and see if in practice, in fact, this will do what we want it to do to the suspension. It is much lighter, 
There is a significant weight loss by using these parts, but if they don't perform the functions that we wanted them to, suspension-wise, we'll likely have to change a bunch of things. If they do work out, we will test a subsequent version, and who knows, maybe at some point we will release these to our racers as part of the works program. So, that's it for this episode. Hopefully you guys will check out the next episode. We'll be debriefing from our test and tune track day last Sunday. We found some interesting things about this setup. I won't give it away in this episode. You'll have to see the next one, but we have some fun things to tell you. See you guys next time.